Okay, so I'm going to show you how to make those pill bottle uh, swarm lures. What I took were the little plant crystals. See them? They're little water absorbing crystals. And I put them into a little pill bottle. It doesn't take much at all. I mean, not at all. Two pinches. Probably got you covered. And then just add some water. And what we want to have happen is that the crystals are going to absorb the water. Now, if it makes you feel better, you can put the lemongrass oil in here now. It doesn't matter because I don't think it really gets absorbed. And of course, I put some marbles in mine so that when, for one, it gives it some weight, but then also when I shake it, it will um, take. Maybe add another few crystals. Last time I did this, I added too many. It took a couple minutes for it to start getting solidified. You sort of add a little, and you stop. Let's give it just a few moments, okay? I'll add a couple crystals in it. They still smell like Swarm Commander. I think I had like a little bit of, they rehydrate, this is a cup I put it in, it still smells like it, but the bees seem to prefer the lemongrass oil. So anyways, you just add enough until the crystals get all absorbed up. It might take a few minutes, be patient, and for the purpose of this video, I might not be able to let that finish, but that's basically what I do is I just wait about five minutes and come back and you'd be shocked. It would be all absorbed up. And so the next part, what I did was I took a piece of screen and I put it over here and just rubber band it really good. And once the water's all absorbed, it's just like a jelly in there. So nothing's going to drip out. And you sort of shake it up a little bit, and the marbles will help distribute the moisture. Uh, and then what I do is I took a piece of window screen. You know, I put window screen over my hives, and they propolize it. So it's, it's just a piece of window screen that I laid over my hive with a lot of propolis on it. And I just took this. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I attached it to a, I thought I had a coat hanger, but I attached it to a fly swatter, just rubber damp banded it to a fly swatter, and then just kind of sort of wrapped this around it so that it's hanging and the bees are hanging on it. And I'll show you kind of what I just did. I had a coat hanger here to attach it, but you get the idea. Here, I'll show you one. Here you go. It's just attached. I may have a little piece of wax there, right about there. Kind of gets it going. And they got all this propolis screen. Work today! Uh, seems like I have a pretty consistent bunch of bees on here, and every day it grows and grows. And so this one's about half full. This is about two weeks. Um, it's just a jelly in there. And they sure do like their pill butter queen. And all I do is I just hang, just took the fly swatter hook. You see, it's attached with a rubber band. And uh, I just simply hung it up on the edge of the tent and the canopy. 
and today a queen appeared. And it was pretty, you know, a, like a softball size or a tennis ball size cluster that appeared. It was probably like two or three times this. And um, these bees will be here day and night, and they'll grow and grow and grow. And I was just about to give them a queen. And when I did, I, I attached the little mason jar queen to it. The queen that was in the swarm came and, and tried to attack her. So I guess that's a trick. If you don't know if there's a queen in there, and you take a queen. Hold on, I got an example. Got a mason jar queen. She's in there. The queen's in there. Got her marked. And you just sort of attach her clipper, safety pinner, you know, the little thing to it, whatever, just attach it to the little thing. If there's a queen in this cluster, she'll come right and get on this, uh, this right here because she'll want to get to that queen that's in there. Now these bees aren't hers, although they'll probably be fine with her. And I'm sure if I attached them, I probably could just attach them tonight. But I've got them right by each other. And it seems like these bees are different from these bees. Her bees are in a nuke. I put them away because I was going to rehang this. And I wanted to be sure that the ones I was hanging, when I hung this again, the bees that came back weren't hers. But anyways, that was my trick. Caught me a queen today. And it's still good. It's been about two weeks it's in there. It still smells real great. Um, it works. It works. <laughs>